We're now going to do a walkthrough of the site, explaining everything, then go over to the stupa, the chadia, and then afterwards do some chanting. Yeah. And I will be coming afterwards very close. What to do? Do a blessing. Is it a big blessing or a small blessing? Mega blessing, Raja. A mega power blessing. So please stay as much as you, long as you can. We'll be right next to you in a few moments. Of course, if you want to come closer to here, you can do in maybe about nine months time when it's all finished and join our first retreat. Is that a good idea? <laughs> Very good. We are indeed so fortunate and blessed that Ajahn was able to make it to Melbourne this time after a number of cancellations uh, over the past two years. So this visit is so special because this is the first time that Ajahn is seeing for himself the newly constructed buildings of the stage one project which was completed about one uh, it's the monks' uh, sangha house and the monks' huts, and and um, and we are really grateful to Ajahn for agreeing to spend a little bit longer with us at Newbury this time, and stay in the specially constructed Mahatera Kuti. Thank you so much, Ajahn. Very good. You're welcome. <laughs> it's very nice and very quiet and very peaceful. Thank you. Um, I now will hand over to Ajahn Brahm and Ajahn Mudito uh, for a walk through the site, uh, through on the site. Um, Ajahn Mudito is the monk who is looking after the building side of uh, the project and he's got background knowledge about cons construction. So I'll hand over to Ajahn Mudito and, uh, to, and, and to Ajahn Brahm. Uh, so that they can take you, walk you through the site. Thank you. Thank you, Ajans. Excellent. Do you hear me? Yeah. This is when a monk holds a microphone, their own power recharges the batteries so easily. Right, that's, that's true. Yeah. I, I hope it works. For <laughs> otherwise, we're in deep trouble. Okay. Very good. Okay, so now we're going to do a walking tour. By the way, just so let everybody know, we were going to do online thing at the same time, but you know what happens? The internet just died. What yeah, to do? Well, that's a good sign because it means that when people do come here to meditate, the internet is not so good, which means you cannot get in contact with anybody. That's so you can really get into deep meditation. That's true. And yeah. this is what we build, why we're building a center. So, Ajahn thank you for Thank you for coming, Ajahn Brahm. Sorry, I have to point that way even. Yeah. So, um, Ajahn Brahm. Yes. Where are we standing now? Do you know what this is? Where are we standing now? It is um, it's dirt. Yes. Uh, <laughs> what is it going to be? This is going to be our Dana Sala. What does Dana Sala mean? It means where people give generous, generously uh, to everybody who comes here. Uh, lay men, lay women, monks and nuns, uh, where we get fed. When you come here for your uh, retreats, this is actually where uh, you will eat. That's it. And also, this doubles up. This will double up as a meditation center, meditation hall, rather. And what's the reason for that? It's because the first stage is stage two A of this project, and that will be. Uh, the, uh, the parking, reception, the, the cottages, and also the place to eat. And we only eat in the morning times, so it means that in the afternoon and evening, the, I suppose, the tables and chairs will be put away. So this is where we will do our meditation in the afternoons, evenings, and also in the mornings. That's true. So well, for us to do, to start this project, like Adam Brahm said, we have a, this, is it yeah, no. breaking up? To start this project, we had to divide this into two sections. So we have 1A and 1B. So this is just a 1A project now, but right. 
we are doing pretty well because we are actually now starting to build this and we are st but we are still <laughs> raising funds for this just so you know <laughs> hint hint but we are doing pretty well and i just point out Dajun Brahm. so i can you see there where the next of the beaches lane when everybody drove in next to this we have a new electric post so we just got a last week we got a three-phase electric here people driving in here then we have this roundabout here everybody drives here drops off the food the dana this is the main stairs in front of us kitchen on our right Dajan. there will be so you can when you come here people can heat up the food like you said you were correct this is the dana sala the dining hall and and here we have to double this in the beginning we have to double this as a as a dining hall and meditation hall there will be a little asana a little seat for the monks and nuns to eat there in front and then when you have retreats here hopefully Adam Brown will come to our first <laughs> retreat no promises but uh, and hopefully everybody will join us for the retreat my arm is very sore it's been twisted a lot in the last week and ma in many directions <laughs> and so this we have to double the double up this as a dining hall meditation hall the dhamma hall will be later on you see there on on the what well, the top of the building side there will be all the, where we have those building um what would you call those containers where we have now the side managers and all those stuff that will be actually the, the dhamma hall the uh, meditation hall later that's the stage 2b and then 2a we're meditating here on the bottom but let me you know be calm no worries Ajahn Brahm this will also even though it's just a dining hall we made it look like it's a um, proper meditation hall excellent okay so let's move a little bit forward let the camera go a little bit Ajahn calm down Calm down. Alright, be careful. And you can see Ajahn on, on our left. There's a two um, foundation for it's breaking up my microphone, sorry, it's okay. There's two huts there on the top and every every hut will have six rooms. So there's two on the top and two on the bottom. And do the rooms have their own ensuite? Yes, funny that you ask. <laughs> it was one of the things you insisted, Ajahn Brahm, Indeed. that we have every room should, ha should have their own toilet, bathroom, sh own shower. So if you want to wake up 3 o'clock in the morning, go a shower, you'll be fine. Everybody else will be just nice and relaxed. You don't have to disturb others. And also, all the rooms we should have be very comfortable. We have double glazing windows, floor heating. Newbury is actually we 800 meters above the sea level here. This is one of the highest points behind us. If everybody looks behind you, that's called the Blue Mountain, and that's the highest spot, spot on this region. That eight, that's 840 meters, perhaps we 800 meters above the sea level here. So this is actually quite windy and cold climate. And let's go on Ajahn towards the cottage and I explain a little bit more about the okay. cottage. You know, one of the reasons why we uh, started having en-suites in every cottage was because as many elderly people would like to meditate and sometimes they have difficulties sleeping at night. Sometimes they need to go to the toilet. Not only that, there's people with things like cancer and other diseases and they've get so much benefit out of meditation. If we make it more comfortable for them, then that, those benefits can even heal cancers. Old elderly people like me <laughs> can also uh, come to the retreat centers. They don't need to feel scared of joining in and having a comfortable uh, place where you can meditate, get good food, and also sleep well at night. That's true. Okay, so Ajahn, I explained the layout a little bit of the, the, the this is the one of the, this is number three actually in front of us. We can see we put blinding concrete down a little bit, this, uh, the sewer pipes are in, but not more than that yet. So we're just still underground pretty much yet. But 
as you can see, this is like an L shape. So why we did the L shape is the reason is we're trying to create Snoopy, like I said, we're pretty high up here. And as you can see, we're almost above the tree level in some places. There's, we're trying to create this kind of buffer zones where we sort of protect it from the wind. So all of these huts will be when the, the 2B will come here, we have like an inner courtyards. So every hut, every hut has a like a own the inner courtyard. The same thing like what we have in front of us. This is like inner courtyard where we have the stupa. We explain a little bit more about the stupa when we get there. But also with the with the cottage here, we have a long corridor. When you enter, you enter this long corridor like your hotel. A lot of people know the corridors in hotel. So you can like uh, you can do meditation, uh, walking meditation inside of the corridor. Um, all rooms will be separated from that, so it'll be nice and quiet. And also, if you do longer retreats, there's a little kitchenette where you can make a cup of tea in the corner there, cup of tea. We also put a washing machine if you stay for the range retreat, perhaps three months, yes. long retreats. Do your own little laundry here, so you don't have to go to the main laundry area. It's just where we came behind, it's the main laundry. But this. Yeah, and all the cottages are the same. So we have now four cottages coming in this first stage. So that's that's how it is. Should and be in the first stage, there'll be how many rooms in total? Twenty-four rooms. So I only twenty-four rooms. What happens if more people want to come on retreat? At the, at the beginning, we are going to double up the rooms. And also, Aya Upeka has kindly agreed to give some of her rooms for the retreats. So that, and they ha there is a lot of space there, and so kindly he has agreed for the stage one. When you come for a retreat, especially, you need at least 50 places. So she has kindly given us the rooms for the retreats. Oh, that's very kind. But later on, when the other cottages are built, how many rooms will there be in all? Uh, altogether, it will be 60 rooms when it's all completed. That's true. That's one in each one with en suites. And then uh, it Dhamma will hall. come up with the Dhamma hall, the meditation hall right on top of the mountain. That's, That's going to be five star? Six, yes, six not star. Five, six star. I think it we're aiming for six. Isn't six better than five? Yes. <laughs> and we are going up, one up above Jana Group. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. No. What's the, what's the what up? Uh, <laughs> floor heating. Oh, floor heating. Floor heating. Oh. It's like, Jana Grove is really nice. Uh, if you don't know, that's Jana Grove is our meditation retreat center in Perth. Oh, yeah. Podignana. And, and there's, oh, and that's, it's five stars, but yeah, we, we're a little bit, five oh, and a half here. Makes me embarrassed. Yeah. Okay, when I go back, I'm going to do some renovations. Oh. <laughs> and by the way, I forgot, I'll just, uh, now that I see, there's actually, caretakers cottage there on the top so that caretakers are a little bit separated from the build, uh, bi um, the main building so that's another thing anybody volunteering for the caretaker takers we're caretaker. advertising here already uh, already <laughs> but hopefully by December we need a caretaker here we need to also another thing yes we need volunteers for the center we need care you know our people to do the model lawn what else all kind of maintenance people yeah that would be wonderful to have so many people doing maintenance because this is our center. Yeah, I'm from the, the West. Uh, this is the Buddhist Society of Victoria. And this is not just Theravada. We have Venerable Atik Fork Tan over there. Where is he gone? There he is. A very good friend. Uh, it doesn't matter what type of uh, place you come from. Everybody is welcome. That's one of the things why we have things like um, places for disabled people to come, places for elderly people to come, so that we can make this as wide open as possible so everybody will feel welcome when they come here and they can just learn some nice meditation, some nice peaceful practices, especially when they get old and sick. I don't know why I keep talking about old and sick. Maybe it's because of my age now. I think, but yes, but we need young people as well. Oh yeah, young people volunteers. What? Not just volunteer, meditate. And cooks. And cooks and yeah. all those things. But don't you feel, everybody here, how <laughs> quiet it is? If Ajahn Brahm and Ajahn, we wouldn't be talking so much, how quiet it is here in this Newbury building site? How quiet, peaceful it? 
it's going to be. Yes. Yeah, it's a very good energy here. <laughs> and I think if once we've been here 10, 20 years, of the energy will just build. It will indeed. And I always say in a place like this, if you don't get deeper meditation, you may always ask for your money back. <laughs> That's true. You won't get it back, but you will always be able to ask for it. <laughs> That's correct. But okay, so Ajahn, now that we explained a little bit of the, the, the dining hall, uh, meditation hall, let me say here is our stupa. So this will be the sort of the central courtyard. Again, trying to be covered with the other buildings so we don't have a lot of wind here. Nice and calm place. You can come and meditate during the daytime. And do you see our beautiful Buddha? Do you know where that comes from? Uh, <laughs> yes, it came from over there because it was over there yesterday. I know, but before <laughs> that, it came in a <laughs> container and came from which ship. Do you know where it yes, came from? That came uh, from. One of the other groups, which I'm sure they will be here to join the retreats, the Ahi Pasiko Foundation over in uh, Jogjakarta. That's where Borod Pador Stupa is. And this is made out of the same stone as was uh, the Borod Pador Great Stupa. And it is very beautifully done. I'm sure you'll have a chance to see it afterwards. You can actually see, I can see the picture there. It will be inside a container with now you can see inside, uh, and even though I know that some people have said, well, it's very low, when it's actually on this stand over here, it will be higher than a, uh, where a person is uh, standing. Uh, obviously, in the main hall, uh, where the meditation hall, once that's built, that will be a, another Buddha statue in there, which will be higher. But nevertheless, it's a very beautiful thing in the very middle of all the cottages. A very beautiful thing to see. And it's very well done. And this was actually given to us by some uh, the disciples over in Indonesia. And especially by, I must say, for one monk, a venerable Sri Panyawado. Uh, he's an Indonesian Theravada monk over in Indonesia. I've known him many years, and he's a very nice, wonderful monk, very kind and very generous. So he arranged this by his disciples over in Indonesia. Mm, that's true. So it is beautiful that we actually got the Borobudur Stupa here. And like Ajahn said, when we, when we open, then please everybody come and see how it's, it's going to turn out. And this is another nice volunteer work. We actually, Ajahn, we, we, instead of paying the builders, these are the little things we're going to do ourselves. So yeah. we need some volunteers to build the Stupa for us. It will be a nice little project. Yes, wonderful. But also, once it's finished, there is a, an old legend with the Borod Pador stupas, and that is that once it's installed inside its little shell, if you can put your hand in the holes and touch the Buddha inside, then the legend says you will find true love. Oh. And if I see any monks or nuns trying that... <laughs> but our true love is... The triple gem. The triple Buddha gem. Buddha Dhamma <laughs> So perhaps we find the Buddha's wisdom if you touch the Buddha. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah. Again, here, the, this will be uh, in four sides. Will be there will be corridors going around, and then uh, we have walk walkways over here. So, but the Buddha, the the stupa will be the central point of the central axis of the the whole center. Very good. I think we explained enough. I'll give it to India. Thank you very much, Ajahn Mudito, and thank you very much, Ajahn, for your kind words. Um, now I will hand over to Ajahn Nisarano, who is our resident uh, Bhikkhu Rep, the senior monk, who will be guiding the uh, blessing ceremony uh, on behalf of uh, all the monastics here, the dual Sangha. He will say a few words and then do the blessing ceremony at the Buddha Rupa, uh, the, the uh, Buddha statue side, uh, stupa side, and then afterwards, uh, Ajahn will come. Um, uh, there will be a chanting by the monastics, and Ajahn will be doing a blessing. He will come over to you, closer to you, to do the blessing. Thank you, Ajahn. So.
Wonderful to see so many people come this afternoon. And of course, this is the heart of the ceremony when we do the blessing of the Buddha statue and the area where the stupa will be. And uh, we'd, first of all, I'd like to say on behalf of the Newbury community, the fourfold community, that's the fully ordained monks, nuns, laymen and laywomen, to, to say thank you very much to our uh, Tanjan Brahm for coming, for making time. It's been really inspiring and delightful to have him here. And thank you for making the time. I also thank COVID-19. Because <laughs> otherwise he wouldn't be staying at the monastery. He'd probably be in the city, actually. So we've had a lovely time with him. And I'd also like to thank the monks who have come today. Thank you very much, because it was at very short notice. And especially uh, Venerable uh, Tik Fok Tan, and, uh, who's from the... Uh, Kwan Min Temple in Braybrook, Braybrook, and also here we are over on my left, Venerable Vimlanyana, who's the senior monk, the Mahatera at the uh, Ripple Brook Meditation Centre. So, and not last but and not least <laughs> is Ajahn Sadaro here, who is our resident monk in the city <laughs> centre in East Malvern. The Buddhist Society of Victoria City Centre. Thank you very much for coming and also for your contribution to setting up. So thank you very much for that. And when we have the opening ceremony, which will be towards the end of this year, we hope to invite more monks. We should have a lot more Sangha here and it will be a lot more comfortable for everybody. <laughs> they can sit down, there'll be shade and all that. So very good. But just to let you know that the format for it, we'll be chanting some of the Buddha's teaching in a Pali language, if you're wondering what language it is, for those that don't know much about the, the chanting we do. And the chanting will be focused, opening with the Ratana Sutta, a famous sutta. It's the Jewel Sutta. And it's, uh, the jewels, of course, are the Buddha, Dhamma and Sangha, the exquisite qualities of the Buddha, Dhamma and Sangha. And at the beginning of that sutta, there's an invitation to the devas. The devas are the heavenly beings. We invite them to come here to support this center, to uh, protect this center, uh, to encourage practitioners. So that's part of the beginning of the Ratna Sutta. And the Ratna Sutta also touches on meditation, insight, and particularly the qualities of a person that has attained the first stage of enlightenment, uh, stream entry. So that will be the, the uh, main focus for the uh, chanting, but we'll also have the Iti Piso, the famous Iti Piso, which also reflects on the qualities of the Buddha, Dhamma and Sangha. And we'll finish with the actual blessing chanting will be the second part of the Metta Sutta. Most people know it. It begins with Metancha Sabalokasmin. So as we uh, are blessing the Buddha statue, as Ajahn Brahm is blessing the Buddha statue, we'll be chanting this. And later on, when he's blessing everyone else, we'll also be chanting it. And it's a lovely because the symbolism... Yeah. The symbolism is, of course, radiating metta. So when we're uh, sprinkling the water, when Ajahn Brahm's sprinkling the water, it's like radiating metta. And... Indira, just remind me, and I was going to say that too, if you know the chants, please join in. You're welcome to join in. The more, the merrier. So now we can have the uh, blessing chanting, and we'll all uh, come near the stupa, I think. And uh, we've got a uh, ball of string connecting all the, uh, the, the Buddha statue, and we can all hold okay. that, I think. so. There we are. Now. And again. Yes, yes. And please excuse oh, myself you. and a few of the other monks for wearing the hats to protect us from uh, the sun and skin cancer. But this particular hat here, that I will let you know that at the end of the ceremony today, it will be auctioned <laughs> to raise funds to pay off our builders. So have a look. Okay, so. Okay, who's. This side, okay. Because this side. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, the other side. Yeah. Oh, okay. Sorry. We can do it. We can do it the other way. Okay. Are you ready? Is that enough microphone? Okay, do we need this one? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. We'll do the.
speaking now. Oh. Okay. We'll do it. Okay. Okay. We'll do Sprinkling it afterwards. Yep. Oh no, you don't want that, that mark. You got that mark. It's okay, yes, I think we can hear. Okay. Should be the whole sanga. Does this? Are you ready? Yeah. Over there. Good. I think the knife has been connected that side. Okay, very good. Begin with the Namo Tassa. Namo Tassa Bhagavato Alahato Sama Sambuddhasa Namo Tassa Bhagavato Alahato Sama Sambuddhasa Namo Tassa Bhagavato Alahato Sama Sambuddhasa Yani da Bhutani Samagatani Bhumma Niwayani wa Antali Ke Sabewa Bhutasumana Bhavan to Ato Bisaka Chasunan to Basitam Tasamahi Buddha Nisameta Sabe Metankaro Tamanusia Pajaya Diwaja Rato Chaharantiye Baling Tasma he never cut up a mata, young king she wit tuck, eat a E te na sa che su wa ti ho tu ka yang vi ra ga amatang panita yata cha ga sa kya muni samahito na te na dame na samati kin si dam pi dame ratanang panita E te na sa che na su wa ti ho tu yam buddha se to pari wa na yi su ching samadhi ma nan tari kan yama hu samadhi na te na samo na vi cha ti dam pi dam me ratanang panitang E te na sa che na su wa ti ho tu ye pu ka la a ta sa tang pa sa ta cha ta ri e ta ni yu ga ni hon ti te da ki ne ya su ka ta sa sa wa ka e te su din na ni ma ha pa la ni ta Pisange ratana panita e te na sa che na su wa ti ho tu ki na wa dal he na ni ka mi no go ta ma sa sa na hi te pa ti pa ta amatang wi ga halada muda ni puting punjamana idam pisange ratanang panita e te na sa che na su wa ti ho tu ki nang nang na wang na ti sambawa virata chi tayati ke bawasmi Te ki na bija, awirul hi chanda, 
นิพันธิติวะยะทายังพาธิปุอิธรรมพิสังเกตวาทนังพานิทัเอเทนะสัจเจนะสวัสดิโหตุยานิตาปุตตสัมมาคัตานิปุมานิวะยานิวะอันตัลิเคทัตตาคัตังเทวมนุสัพุชิตังปุตังนามาสัมสวัสดิโหตุยานิตาปุตตสัมมากัตานิปุมานิวะยานิวะอันตัลิเคทัตตาคัตตังเทวมนุสัพุชิตังธรรมังนามาสัสวัสดิโหตุยานิตาปุตานิสัมมากัตตานิปุมานิวายานิวันตัลิเกทัตตาคัตตังเทวมนุสัพุชิตังสังกังนามาสัมมาสุวัตโหตุอิทิพิโสปกะวะอะระหะสัมมาสัมปดุวิจาจารณะสัมพันโนสุกัตโตโลกะวิตุอานุตโรภุริสัตมะสาวะทิสัตเตวะมนุสานะปุตโตปะกะวะทิสุวะขะโตปะกะวะตาธรรมสันดิติโกอาคาลิโกเอหิปัสิโกโอปนัยโกปัจจัตเวทิตาปุวินยุหิติสุปฏิปันโนปะกะวะโตสาวะกะสังโกอุจุปฏิปันโนปะกะวะโตสาวะกะสังโกยายะปฏิปันโนปะกะวะโตสาวะกะสังโกสามิจิปฏิปันโนปะกะวะโตสาวะกะสังโกยาติดังชะตาวิภุริสกาณิยาตาภุริสัพุกะลาเอสัพกะวะโตสาวะกะสังโกอาหุเนยโยอาหุเนยโยตาคิเนยโยอัญชาลิกาณิโยอนุตรังปุญญาเกตังโลกาสัตติเมทันชะสัพโลคัสมิงมาณสัมบาวายาปาริมาณังอุตังอโตชะทิริยังชะสัมบาดังอเวรัคอาสัพตะทิทันชะวังนิสิโนวะสายโนวะยาวะทัสสวิกัตมิตุเอทังสัตติอาทิตย์ยะบรามะเมตตาวิหารังอิตามาหุติทิชาอนุปกรรมสิลาวะตาสเนนะสัมพันโนคามิสุวินเนยเกตังนาหิจารุกาปเสยะพุนเวทิทิสาดูสาดูสาดู Very good. So that so that is the other blessing for this Chaitya site, and it's a wonderful thing that you are here when it happened, and you can always remember that you are the very beginning of this meditation retreat center. I know certainly the retreat center over in Perth has done a wonderful job. Many, many people have got great meditations there, and I hope. And eventually, maybe our kids can come here to meditate, and when they come here to meditate, solve so many problems, so many difficulties, health and emotional problems. I hope it's going to be a wonderful resource. Already over in the West, we have lots and lots of bookings. And sometimes we can't fit everybody in because it's so popular, and this is one of the reasons why 
I'm very happy to come. A second retreat center, you're not looking at the people over there. A second retreat center so that we can have more and more people uh, doing retreats. It's also a wonderful place. Many monks and nuns have become monks and nuns because they've got deep meditation on the retreats. And I put my hand up. It wasn't a retreat center in Australia, but another retreat, a very deep meditation that made me a monk. And so there's lots and lots of people come here, have a great time, see deep dhammas, and thereby want to renounce in the world. This is a huge resource and a great benefit for the Buddhist Society of Victoria and beyond to all Buddhists, all meditators in this part of the world. And later on, this will be a very famous, well-known, well-used retreat center. Thank you all for coming. Now I believe Thank yeah. you. Thank you so Thank much, you. Ajahn. Sadhu, sadhu, sadhu. sadhu, sadhu. sadhu. Um, now I will hand over the mic to Adrian T, who is the secretary uh, of the Buddhist Society of Victoria, who has Thank done you. immense work uh, everywhere for a for few years, not like us, like for a lo few long years. And he's never, for. Uh, we are really grateful uh, for the service that he is doing and he's, he has done in the past and still doing. Uh, over to Adrian. Thank you. Oh. Thank you, Indira, for the kind words and very generous indeed. We are like all of you here, we are here to serve the community. More importantly, the Buddhist sasana, to make sure that the, we have such center here to benefit all humanity. We need more peace and more happiness in this world. And I hope that this new Buddhist Buddhist center, the second purpose-built meditation center in Australia after Jana Grove. Thank you, Ajahn Brahm, for helping us to realize this dream. And it is such great pleasure and happiness and joy that we finally have seen this meditation center taking shape and starting with this foundation that we have built with the arrival of the Buddha statue from Indonesia that came last, just last Friday. Uh, two weeks ago, actually, last Friday, for these special occasions. And we also thanks to the devas here, who has been very, very protective of the monastic here, as well as the lay people. Even here today, it was forecasted to be 60% rain and with thunderstorm. And look at the glorious sky, nice and blue and warm. I'm sure it will be a very significant indication of such a great center that we will become in the future. Once this is built, this center will benefit everyone who want to seek to walk the Buddha path and all, or simply just to do meditation. We all know the benefits of the meditations. It helps to reduce mental suffering. And with that, we hope that, uh, that the, this, this center, once it's built, it will benefit many generations to come. And with your kind support, I'm sure this will be realized even to the, the beginning of the stage 2B and then the stage 2, 3, uh, stage 3, which will be the nun section. And um, this, and i like to thank Ajahn Brahm for taking the special occasions to come to Melbourne to, uh, to, 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 to open this uh, special occasion. And I'd like to thank the special venerable, Venerable Thich Nhat Hanh. No, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> very much take for time. <laughs> Sorry, very much take for time from Kwamin Temple, Venerable Vimalanana from Ripple Brook Meditation Center, Ajahn Sadhu from uh, our city center, and all the uh, Newbury monks led by Ajahn Isarono here, and the nuns led by Ajahn Aya Opeka here, and, and the lay people and lay men and women who stay at the Newbury. These special occasions requires a lot of organization and effort and planning. I'd like to thank Lai, who has been very meticulous with this coordination and planning, even within a very short notice, given that we didn't want to plan this event too far ahead because of the pandemic. We had done this before in the past few times, and we had to cancel the last minute. So thank you to the team, the co organizing committee team, led by Indira, Jasmine, Chinta, Terry, uh, the treasurer, Varuna, um, 
uh, yes, been to Seoul, yep, and uh, yep. I think all the community members here, and also, yeah, also the special mentions to Sri Jude, who, uh, and his, uh, his audio video team, who actually tested and uh, figured out how to get the internet working in this, uh, uh, in this groundwork here. And uh, they spent a lot of time, and you can see that they, they are more or less almost roasted already, but uh, they have been uh, doing this so meticulously to get this event running so smoothly. I also like to thank Vali, who has been working very hard behind the scene to get a lot of the posters and all the publications going. And I'd like to thank all the volunteers um, who, yeah, and Ravi's group for helping us to organize um, all the, uh, the setup and the uh, patrolling and the ushering and all the other volunteers. BSV has been relying, and relying on volunteers for the past 60, uh, 16, 8, 69 years already. And I'm sure that it will continue to do so with the help of the volunteers, that this BS, BSV, New Buddha Center, will flourish and bring happiness and peace to everyone. All of you who contributed towards this organization should be mentioned and uh, and should receive also the merits for all your kind, noble effort. So, we, before talking too much, I think I've spoken too much, we shall move on to the next sessions, the second part of the sessions, whereby we all go back to the nuns area. No, no, where no, no. Oh, yes, sorry, there'll be a blessing. After the blessing, uh, after the blessing of all of you who, um, who have so kindly attended here, we will have, we'll have a second session here, whereby we will have a, some, some afternoon teas, as well as have... Um, catch up uh, talks with Ajahn Brahm in the Nance area. So don't run away and enjoy your time here. Thank you. I shall pass on to Ajahn Brahm, who will walk around here to bless all of you. Sadhu, sadhu, sadhu. So, I don't know if that's working, yes, I think it's working, so we can, now we will be doing this, the chanting, uh, the radiating metta, as I mentioned, when, which we did when uh, we were blessing the Buddha statue in Stupa, so now the monks and nuns will, there we are, and uh, where's Anjan? Ah, oh, there you are, Bhante, there we are, thank you, there we are, we can, there we are, so we will do the chant as Ajahn does the blessing. Etancha samalokasmi manasam bhava ye aparimanam udang adocha tiriyancha samadam averam asapatam titancha ramisino masayano Manasambhavaya parimana 
Tancha samba lo casmin, mana samba la ye aparimana, utanga doja tiriancha sambada, avera sapata, itancha ranisinova, sayanova, yavata sabigata mito. Metancha samba lo kasmin, mana samba vaye aparimana, utang adocha tiriancha sambada, avera masapata, titancha ranisinova, sayanova, yavata sabigata mito, Etang sating adite yaramameta viharang ilamahut Itincha anupagang masirawa dasane na sampano Kame susuline yageda na hijatu kapaseya punaretiti Metancha samba lo kasmin, mana samba vaye aparimana, utang adocha tiriancha sambada, awera asapata, titancha ranisinova, saya. Metancha samba lo kasmin, mana samba ye apalimanang utang ato jatiriancha asampatang awerang asapata titancha lang ni sinowa. Saya noa ya wata sawi kata mito etang sating ati taya prama metang wihara hitamahuti tinja anu pakam masilawa dasane na sampano kami suwi na ya kita nahija tu kapasaya. Punale titi metancha samba lo kasmin mana samba waye apalimana utang ato jatiriancha asampatang awerang asapata 
ติทันจะลังนิสินโนวะสยานโนวะยาวะตาสวิกาตมิโตเอตังสติงอติเทยพระมเมตังวิหาระหิตามาหุติตินจาอนุปคัมมาสีลวะตาสเนนะสัมปันโนกามเมสุวินัยยเกตังนาหิจัตุกาปเสยังคุณเลติติเมตันชาสัมบาโลกาสมิงมานะสัมบาเยอะพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้วพอแล้ว